listen, it's the message right here. Black boy, tell me how you really feel. Cause I just wanna build with you. Black girl, tell me how you really feel. I wanna keep it real with you. I wanna live better, eat better. I wanna love better, sleep better. Yeah, I wanna feel so aligned. As part of a conversation, you 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 change. It's like a painting. As you're painting the painting, you're changing it and you're tweaking shit. But that's the beauty of the shit. It's not perfect, but it's art. People gonna say to see this and be like, "What the fuck she talking about?" They gonna say a lot of things. It's, they gonna say I'm lying. They gonna say the the video that has the most views. It was um, a friend of mine named Sid. Mm-hmm. I had comments from, damn, her feet pretty as hell, to cap, to we need this, to like, it's all over the place. Oh, So that's okay. why I tell people, just be honest. Niggas are gonna say what they're gonna say. Some True. people ain't even gonna watch the video. They just gonna see a thumbnail and be like, fuck her, whatever she's saying. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck what she talking about. This and that, her beanie ugly, shit dusty. Like, so, <laughs> so again, it's, it's, but what we're doing is bigger than all that. Mm-hmm. So pick it up from where you left off. And where did I leave off? That the ideal man, that nigga, his ideal woman. Okay. No kids. Mm. Responsible on her shit. Down to earth, well rounded, family oriented, respectful, polite. Okay, perfect. All that good shit. Third part of the question. I suspect if I was to ask a hundred women to describe their ideal dude, they would describe that nigga, right? Somewhere in the ballpark. Somewhere, probably. Now, the question is, do you think most of the women who would describe that man are his ideal woman? Probably not. <laughs> That's crazy. Probably the hell not. Probably not because it seemed like It's like, basically like, a nigga take you on a date and you ordering all the expensive shit, but it's like, would you get that for yourself if you was going to eat with you and your friends and stuff like that? So, we want what we can't have, but like... It go the same for men too. Men want what they can't have either. Like, I remember watching this Kevin Samuels video, and he answered this girl call, and she was like, she wanted this man with all these qualities and stuff, but like, he was like, you're this old, you're average looking in the face, you have three kids. By two different men and all, but you want a man that this and da, da, da. So it's usually, it usually doesn't go like that. Like, that's why it's so hard for us to like be with who we want because like a man's ideal woman is probably not gonna be her ideal man, like if it was him trying to find you know like do you get what I'm saying if it was him trying to find her it wouldn't be she wouldn't pick him if he was picking her basically and that's basically what I'm saying do you get what I'm saying I get what you're saying because okay. like that's a good point if if a woman said all these things would he even choose her? Would, would, do you hold the qualities of the man that you want? 
with all the qualities that you want him to have. So that's kind of hard. And more than likely, it's probably not like. Why do women still think like they deserve that man? Because just like you said, a lot of the women who call Kevin Samuel show, they feel like they, yeah, they, they qualify going, for that man. I ain't going to lie. Like, they be tripping. Like, if you see the kind of like, I'm just like, I get, like, why we want the things we want. But, like, they got to match up, too. Like, like nine times out of ten, that man ain't going to choose you. Because cause then if you want a man of, like, a certain... A certain status in life or a certain caliber, like you got to think about how many of the same women want him too. You want a man with all this money who look good and can do all this for you, but you know how many females want him too? And you think he going to choose your average looking three kid having, you know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> okay. he ain't average. So, ain't no above average nigga gonna want an average female. But no female thinks they're average. And that's why a lot of times, and that's why Kevin Samuels went viral, because that woman, because she made so much money, the average of best right. nigga, she thought she wasn't average. Right. And it don't have nothing to do with that either, because a millionaire could give a fuck if you making 300 k a year. He don't give a fuck about none of that shit. And she trying to shit on the, the man yep. who make forty thousand dollars. Yeah. Because she thinks she's better she than think him. Mm hmm. Yep. Right on the head. That's 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 fucked up. Because I don't really feel like that shit. I mean, it does play a role in all that shit, but I don't think it should. Cause like the man you want is probably the fifty thousand a year nigga. He just ain't got the type of funds you got, but he's probably everything else you want. So you just gonna be like, fuck him, and like, oh my bad, damn. You just gonna be like, fuck him, and chew and try to go after the man that's probably not even looking your way if you walk past him. So. All right. So last question. What type of son do you plan to raise? I plan to raise a son who has morals, integrity, stands for something respectful, treat, treats women the way they deserve to be treated. Some women deserve to be treated bad, though. I was just about to say something. I was just about to say something like that because it's some females who like really believe that that shit don't stink. And you look, you know, I ain't even trying to be funny, but you look like a bunch of nothing and you ain't got nothing going on, but you just think you're that bitch. And some females need to be knocked off their high horse sometimes. I ain't gonna lie, dudes too. But I'm a... Teach my son the difference between those type of females, too. Like, women deserve respect, like, wholeheartedly. But I get what you're saying. Some females don't, like, get that because they don't be respecting themselves. But I think I'll do a good job raising a, raising a son. Not by myself now. Not by myself. I want a family. I want my man in the house, you know doing his fatherly thing, you know, but I think I would do a good job because I'm a woman, so I'm always give him that advice on like how to see women, how to view women, how to talk to women, how to think of women, you know what I'm saying? So, 